Hello there. Let us peek in to see what's in there for this week's newsletter. Here are some highlights for you. Blog and Chow by our expert Siva Kumar. Today's blog. Pouring over PMBOK7. In fact, so it is with other knowledge areas. Take risk management, for example. The references to typical terms like risk register, risk management plan etc. are there mostly in the uncertainty performance domain, and some under the models, methods and artifacts section. Extending this further, one could actually develop a cross-reference of the previous knowledge areas of PMBOK6 and the new performance domains of PMBOK7. It is quite likely that someone in the planet with time on his, her hands has already done precisely that. Challenge of the week is aligning the 12 principles, PMBOK7 and Agile. Many of you would be aware of Agile values and principles. PMBOK7 has also taken a similar approach, defining project management values and principles, leaving it flexible for users to define the practices that best serve the expected outcomes, conforming to the values and principles. So, you have two sets of principles, one Agile and the other from PMBOK7 both with 12 principles each. It would be interesting to see the degree of alignment across the two sets. This challenge of the week, ciao, is a short quiz to see for yourself have a go. Podcast by our guest Muktesh Murthy. Listen to what you can expect. If you handhold them the first time and you teach them how it is, then I think it, it goes further from there, right? It is like, you know, you give a rod, you give a fish to someone and then you, they have to keep giving them fish for forever. But if you teach them how to fish the first time, then I think they can fish on their own. So my belief has always been to keep your hands wet, roll up your sleeves, work with them. Subscribe to our newsletter to read the complete blog, solve the challenge of the week and listen to our podcast's guests. For all the links please check the description box below. Thanks for watching.